What's up, YouTube? So, did a little research and I found that you can get a flex head for your Miller 220. It's a Weldcraft A150F Miller Genuine part right there. And uh, super easy to swap out. You just pull the handle back. Uh, I already loosened this a little. Unscrew the fitting. Just like that. And now we can swap out our TIG Torch consumables. Gonna pull that out. Take off our number eight cup. Take off our gas lens. Take off our little plastic gas lens adapter thing. Snap that on here. Put this guy, put in our gas lens again. Then I'm gonna swap out for a wedge collet, 332nd from Furic. Going to install a Jazzy 10, because I think later today I'm gonna be doing some steel. like that. Get our nice tungsten in here. And our back cap. Going to um, just Lightly install this guy. A hand. Just a couple crescent wrenches and an adjustable Nipex wrench. And um, this doesn't need to be too tight, just tight enough. Should be good. And then I drilled out the inside of this handle just a little bit. And uh, you can see this one's threaded. The old one just has some O-rings. So I just drilled it out a little tiny bit and then it kind of self threaded itself on there. And that's it. And the size drill bit that I used was a, um, see if I can I think it's five eighths yeah I think it's five eighths and that's it and now you have a flex head on your Millermatic 220 without changing the hose or anything really you just literally change out the head so you know you can curve it like that you can you know go down so if you like welding like this or you know, because the the heads typical the heads normally are angled back towards you, kind of like that. That's what that's the normal angle. So now you can go out, you can go right, left, you know, whatever you want. So I thought that was pretty cool. Uh, very cheap upgrade, only like eighty bucks for this head assembly, and everything swaps over. Just have to drill out the the top of the little handle a little tiny bit, and you're done. Thanks for watching.